it's time to reinstall the pump into the housing. Previously, we would talked about this square cut groove on one side of the pump. The other side has just an outlet hole. That's your outlet hole for the oil passage going up to oil the chain. The square cut groove is the pickup. The oil comes from the bottom of the tank and flows through this passage. Down to the hole and then of course into the pump. We have to align that in the housing. So just set it down there. We want to make sure the square cut groove is going parallel to the drive shaft. And then we're going to take just a regular, the, the five millimeter bolt, and thread it in a ways and until it stops. We're going to set that down into the housing. Make sure that it's pointed forward. Then using a, you can use a vise, a block of wood, something that is going to give you support. And a small hammer with gentle taps. We're going to start to install the pump into the groove. Carefully checking. until it's seated. And you will have this much of the pump showing in the bottom of the gear case. Remove that bolt. Now you have the connector and it goes at a right angle. This portion comes through the hole and actually seals that hole. So we're going to work that onto the end of the pump. You squeeze it, it fits down over the pump, seat it into the hole. You'll also notice that it has a small flange built right here that keeps the alignment correct as far as the alignment for the filter to come out straight. You'll also notice that on the bottom of the tank is this tab that protrudes from the rest of the housing. It covers that 90 degree fitting so that debris and other rough surface materials can't damage or push it out of the way and then have a major oil leak. You reinstall the four screws that hold the cover on and now when you install the gearhead onto the power unit you should find that after a few seconds, it will start to oil.